Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. It's me, DJ King. In this video, I'm doing my switch out Saturday, but it was a little late, so I want to show you what I moved out of and what I moved into already, just so you can already be caught up to speed. So, I carried my Dooney & Burke Florentine Extra Large Courtney in the color red, and it was a great carry, of course, because I love my Courtney. She did soften up a little bit, a couple of patina spots on her because it did warm up a little bit. But I mean, this bag is just, it's just beautiful. <laughs> so of course the red was the top of the list that came back, um, not top of the list. It was the first one on the list that came back. And so I was able to get this one. And then my other one that I purchased is also on the way. So as soon as it gets here, I'll show that one to you also. But no complaints about Courtney. I don't think I did much damage to her. She did get bumped up against the desk at work because I was talking to somebody and we were laughing about something. And then next thing I know, but I don't see any potential scars or anything on her. <laughs> so since I figured, you know, my last... um video when I was talking about carrying red bags for the season um it was easy to figure out what to carry decks because I was like well it's a red bag so I literally was going to be lazy and just switch out the same accessories and use them in my next bag but I didn't so what I moved into is the Dooney and Burke East West Chelsea and I did try to jazz her up just a little bit just enough just enough not to overdo it and the only thing I added was this little short chain here that came in the trio set from Amazon. And you just detach it like that on both sides. And this here is the Dooney & Burke bag charm that I love. I believe it's called the Samba Lock, I believe. And so just added that. And I thought that right there was just enough added extra cuteness and that's all i needed so this was the front of my bag so that this part could show obviously but i could have easily put it on this side also but either way this is my carry and i will show you what i have in her um some of the stuff you have not seen and some you have not seen in a while but to get right into it let me move my chair up so i can sit my stuff down this is what it looks like currently before I take anything out. So all this is in there. This middle compartment will zip. That's what it looks like. And the bag has a snap closure here. So just so you can see, that's what it looks like snapped. And on my arm, and I've had it like this, I've had it like that, I've had it when I got my phone and my arms resting on like that, so I've had it multiple ways. But this one is a lot softer than my Courtney because this bag is older. So, just so you can see before I start taking stuff out, both red Florentines. Side-by-side -side comparison, Extra Large Courtney, East West Chelsea. So, just so you can see them before I start manipulating my stuff. <laughs> Alright, so on to the inside here. So, first in here, I have my Coach Nolita. And in this pouch, this was my candy pouch. So candy, cough drops, the usual stuff is in there. And my duck from Suz What. And again, happy birthday to Suz, everyone. And she did reach her over 1,000 subscribers. So she made it. But here we are, Coach Nolita 15 in the color red. Next in here, this item you have not seen in several months. So I pulled her back out. 
This is my Dooney and Burke Lizzie in Florentine in the color natural. This here I used as a catch-all. This thing here I have used a few times as a grab and go on the weekend. It just I just didn't film it just to show you all, but so she does have love marks on her. There's some scratches on here. I guess if I wanted to spend time and rub them out, I could. And it does have a little bit of patina on it, but not much. If any, is some here on the logo. And this is cute. This is really cute. So it's my grabbing, I mean my grab and go, my catch-all piece. So in here is the toiletry stuff, lip balm stuff, and y'all I'm getting to the wire here. And Dazzle Me 77 <laughs> did a community post about this and where she had cut it trying to get that last little bit out. <laughs> I said, totally with you, totally with you. <laughs> but I'm waiting. I'm sure these will be on sale at Bath and Body sometime soon. So this is my shea butter. I have a couple left, but it's getting getting a little close. <laughs> um, I have mascara in here. Um uh, a highlighter pen, some eyeliner, my tape measures in here, some random pens, I think, because I was in a hurry, some clear lip balm, other lip balm. You know, I don't wear lipstick, so it's always lip balms. <laughs> and the uh, Vicks nasal inhaler, uh, EOS. And I always keep these in here for some reason, I guess, so I can remember the name. But this is the Lizzie that I got from QVC, I think March or April. And so the inside, it has that zip pocket in the back. I don't have anything in there but my wet wipes. And on the opposite side, this bag does have a key keeper. And to show you how big the key keeper is, just look at that. <laughs> but on the opposite side, oh. And then my nail file is in there. You have a, I can open it. That's what I thought was interesting about this. You have a slip pocket, but it has a snap closure on it. And as small as this bag is, I mean, I guess if I was putting cash or something in that slip pocket, but it's like as small as this bag is, y'all put a slip pocket in there. So if you got big hands and you trying to reach in there and unsnap it, <laughs> but I didn't use it for anything particular this time. So all that stuff was in there and it just zips closed and the straps on this are not detachable, but I'm okay with that. But you know, I like pieces that I can grab it this way. It fits on my arm in my hand and in comparison to the coach Nolita this is what we're working with there's that so this was the catch-all and this was the candy pouch then I decided to bring back my target pouches this here I just had face mask in here I figured gold shimmer for the holidays so it would coordinate and that's all that I had in there. Then my pencil pouch from Coach. If you don't have one, highly recommend getting one. My keys and my marker because I was labeling something. And then this here you have not seen in forever. This here is the little Coach double zip. I believe they called it a coin case, but I use it as a card case because cards fit in it. I had it in that slip pocket that comes, you know, you have your two slip pockets. So I had it in that one and it was in there vertical. And this thing here, it is double sided. So I'll just unzip it like that. And so I have cards here, 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 and there. And in the back of, let me take out some cards. It's still a slip pocket back here. And then you can put cards in there and it's a slip pocket behind that also and it's like that on both sides so i have ample room but since it's holiday time and i have gift cards for the kids and family sends gift cards to pick up what they need i put them all in there and like store cards that i have and then this year i was out running errands so i had my jersey mics um i threw it in there 
So that was on one side. And that's the two slip pockets. And then, you know, with East West Chelsea, you have this zipper compartment here. And in there, I have my Dunienberg Safiano red coin case. And I emptied the coins out because it got heavy earlier. <laughs> I have some receipts. I have this wallet that is just one that I had from maybe TJ Maxx or Marshalls, one of the two. And it's by the company Dune, D-U-N-E, Dune London. So I liked it because of the print, of course. And I figured that goes with red anytime. Coordinates with my shirt, but yes. And this thing has a little wristlet strap that is detachable. So this is my wallet. And I have been fighting with the wallet for the simple fact um, let me turn around some stuff here. Okay, so I'll show you this way. So like right here is your card slots and then you have a zipper part up here. This zipper part, the struggle to get that. <laughs> so I have some Bath and Body coupons that I put in here just so I would not lose them. And I do have $2 for my son to go to Dollar Tree for his little allowance. My checkbook fits in here um, just fine. And then in the back is just receipts in this slip pocket. So I wasn't sure if the LV thing was gonna fit, but it fit in there quite nicely. So six card slots and the rest of my cards, are, like I say, in this. Um, and receipt paper and this does have a key thing also which my keys never seem to stay on there so on that flip side you have a slip pocket fold up mail i was going through and a target receipt and in the zipper pocket well more stuff here's the registration card that has not been registered a checkbook that i used up that i need to switch out and this is gift cards that I use for some reason. I like to take them back just to make sure I have nothing left on them. Because some do expire, some don't. But I like to always double check before I cut them up and throw them in the trash. And that's all I had in here. So everything paired quite nicely. So we had the East West Chelsea. Let's see if I can set her up for you. So you can see what these accessories looking like. Because at first I was like, well, maybe I'm going to have too much red. But then as long as I have one piece that can kind of break up the, you know, the red. So it didn't look like it was all red. Then I was like, okay, well, this is working. This is working. <laughs> and let's see how I can do this. And there it is. So that was that, and that was my carry, my Dunienberg East West Chelsea in the color red, and this bag, as it gets older, it just carries so much better, it gets softer, so that's what I do love about this Florentine, but what I will say, this Florentine here feels so, so nice, but I still think that these East West Chelsea's are of a different Florentine than, say, like, this Florentine. They're both uh, sturdy and thick or whatever, but this one feels like it has a broken in feel versus this one. Maybe it'll get there after carrying it multiple times, but my natural one, that one is like butter. <laughs> so this one here is slowly getting there. But as of right now, this one, it, it feels like a whole different Florentine because it just, I don't know. It feels lighter, even though it's two different bags, but this one definitely feels lighter. Kind of like my uh, Russell I keep talking about. The steel blue one, it just feels softer. So, but either way, I love them both. Would not get rid of them at all whatsoever. And this one here, I love the way these straps do like that. So I don't have to fight with anything. But yeah, just wanted to come show you my Switch Out Saturdays with DJ King. Sorry the video is late, but... Me and my daughter been out shopping, got my lunch and came back and I said, let me film a video 
and everything and get that out the way before I start wrapping up stuff and putting it under the tree. So again, thank you all so much for watching and I will see you on my next one.